Hello my beautiful buddies and welcome to the channel for a speed build on the Jayador Cafe and Bakery. So this is a bakery originally in The Sims 2 in the sub neighborhoods. We're putting it in Ronaville in The Sims 4 and I kind of made it a hybrid lot just so you guys can get like more use out of the save file and you could choose for it to be a cafe like I said it to be or you could own it and it be like a full on bakery but I've made it compatible for both and I really hope you enjoy the speed build so here we go. So jumping right here into the speed build I kind of want to update you guys first before I start talking about Ronaville in the world. I'm going to actually be away. I'm pre-recording right now. Um, I should have this build up when I'm actually gone. We'll see how I do because I'm planning on like like preloading to upload these but yeah we'll see because lately I have been so good with the editing it's like for some reason I'll edit and then I just won't upload them you have no idea how many times I've like literally had to like re-edit things just because I've forgotten that I've actually edited a build I don't know what it is <laughs> anyway so I'm going to be away um during like the release of um cottage living um so like if I upload another video after this and it seems like I I've recorded it like months ago um that's because I did I did and then like other packs have came out so I kind of forgot about it so you might see another build that like I might be talking like things have happened already like for instance I go on about like wanting to stream and like I have streamed um but yeah I, I didn't like want to like re like do the voiceover because I thought the voiceover was like perfectly fine I just thought that you guys like should know that if I upload another build and I have a little disclaimer at the beginning of it but yeah I just wanted to let that let you guys know about that before I went and went ahead and started talking about this build and things like that because I'm sure you guys are wondering like when like the cottage living stuff is gonna be um because I am part of the game changer program and yes I did get early access um usually early access has like two tiers and I they only give like a fraction of the game changers like of like the beta early access like the ones that are like really early um so like you kind of just have to like wait for your turn I guess like for you to get that sometimes like there's obviously some game changers that like obviously will always get it like James and Deli and like those like really big like important game changers but like the rest of us like we we wait for our turn <laughs> um and yeah so like I'm I got like of course like the the second tier of really access like like the week before but i'm going to be away um so yeah that's why you're not seeing any like early access cottage living stuff but i will do some when i get back i have a really cute idea of like kind of like a little build challenge for it and i am really excited to do <laughs> really excited to do it because i think it'll be cute um because i definitely think too it's like a build that i could put here in ronaville even though i'm doing it for like cottage living release because the new cottage living pack looks so good like it looks so good in Veronaville, like all the items and things like that um and yeah i'm i'm kind of excited for it because i know a lot of you guys that are entering my giveaway which probably should be ended or should be ending soon like 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 by the time that i'm uploading this um that like we what was I saying? Oh, that we were, that it should be like just cute. It should be just like cute for this world. Because like I am going to just keep this in Ronaville. Ronaville in Windenburg. Because I know that's something that you guys, like most of you have wanted when I did the giveaway. Like I asked for a response for it. Um, so yeah, I am going to keep it here. But like I might sneak in a couple of builds just because I think the style like goes well together i think i even can uh, even can update like this like starter cottage that i did i they don't think i put it on the channel i don't think i did i'm not sure but i think i can update that now because like some some things i feel like are better than like what i originally did because like some of them i use like the thatched roof from like the island living thing like i can update that now because like now we're getting thatched roofs like country style um but and yeah anyway i should actually talk about this build now that has like been like nearly like five minutes <laughs> so this build is a cafe and bakery so um it's called the jayador like bakery and cafe usually in the sims 2 the way that the sims 2 works if you've never played before is that you usually get like a main town so you'd usually get like pleasant view strange town veronaville river bra some hills like you you get these like main towns and you pick one 
to like live in you like pick one main town but then like there was expansion packs like we have know and love today um and the expansion packs would add these things called subtowns and subtowns would add like downtown and then like this like little open for business world and like things like that and in them you'd have like these different community lots and for my save file and like when i do like the sims 2 world like like i have been doing is that i go ahead and i'm I pick like worlds from those sub worlds because usually like the main towns don't really have like a lot of community lots in them. So that's kind of like where I'm at today. So I'm using one from I think like the open for business world. Don't quote me on that. And it's called like the Jayador Bakery. However, in The Sims 4, um, I find usually cafes are more usable than like the bakeries are. I just find that way. So like I kind of made it um like able to do both um actually even if you wanted to your sim could even own this and make it a restaurant if you really really wanted to because i put like the kitchen in the basement um so you could change it to a restaurant if you wanted to i have it set as a cafe you could change it to a bakery if you want to own it as a bakery so this lot is like very like versatile like you could use it in so many different kinds of ways um and i just think it's so cute because i feel like it like it looks like it could be a cafe or a bakery for sure like it has a very very cute even almost like instagrammable vibe to it especially too with like the vine walls and like the ginnem like wallpaper like i just thought it was so cute and i just think it's something that like um that like we haven't had in the game before like we haven't had had like such a cute cafe like this um and as you can see too like i did use the like north south coffee whatever it was before like i used the original like skeleton of the building just because i figured if i was going to do a cafe like it's really hard to do in this particular area a different style building than what's already here because all the buildings in the background are in the same like um like tutor style so i kind of just kept the style of the building already like i just kind of like re-renovated it to the max and i ripped out like the the club area to like put like this like reading and like internet cafe corner and i like it so much better because like i just feel like now everybody could use it and there's just so much room in there and yeah i just i just feel like it's really cute and then you got your bathrooms in the back and it's just like the perfect perfect little spot to like have your sims go on like a little coffee date um or just hang out with your friends or just chill there if you don't have a computer i just think it's cute i really liked it i hope you guys like what i did with it as well um and yeah i'm just having a lot of fun doing the save file because like like i've said before i feel like i used to like put a lot of pressure on like the channel of what you guys really wanted to see and things like that but i think as time kind of like went on is that i realized that every single like idea like i can't have an original idea all the time like some people are going to do exactly what i did and things like that i kind of just have to like flow with it as long as i have my own style i feel like you guys will be there and follow me um and yeah i i feel like lately is like as i've kind of like learn that in the channel that there is a place for every different kind of channel and things like that that like I don't know I, I've been having so much way more fun because there was a time during quarantine that like I was just feeling so uninspired because I just had I just like kind of like not like put pressure on myself too much but like I just could not be creative like I was like I can't think of anything original I can't think of anything new but that's the thing I feel like everything is kind of like inspired off of and everybody has kind of done the same things all the time and ideas just kind of and honestly I feel like once you like let go of that more original ideas actually come to you and that's kind of like what I've been feeling lately maybe it's also to the fact that like not everything is like in lockdown anymore um so I feel like things things have just gotten like really really like fun for me again and i hope fun for you in the channel like i'm sure you guys could see like the passion now behind like the builds and things like that and yeah also too something a fun fact too is i've actually cut my hair to and uh, since i've like done the beginning of that video um so like my hair was really really curly in it and something i usually do is like i usually get my hair straightened um so like my hair naturally is that texture but then like i get it straightened so it's easier for me to like wear straight and things like that and oh my god guys it's like been such a long time because i haven't gotten it done 
for like a year and a half. So my hair, I just like let my hair just be natural like I like I did all the time like when I was younger. Um, but yeah, I don't know. It feels so good just to get your hair done, guys. It really does. Um, but as you can see, like I pre-record the beginnings of my videos sometimes. So like that's why you'll see like I'll have like beginnings of these videos because like I'll have recorded it in like April. But like I'll know I've really wanted to do, to do this video. So like I'll just like pre-record it at a time and then you'll have like the beginning of it. Because as you can see, like I'm trying to like even evolve my content a little bit like a tad bit like I like that personal touch sometimes with your face in it and other people's videos so I've been trying like to do some like new things as well I've also been experimenting more with um TikTok TikTok is fun too um and that's something too that I was like didn't ever think I'd I do or be on but yeah it's it's really fun it's really fun I, I recommend it if you guys haven't tried it or yet or something <laughs> But yeah, let me know if you guys like this build and if you guys have any suggestions for any more um, venue builds for for like Veronaville. Um, because like currently I'm kind of just like following kind of like what Windenburg already has. I just kind of have been um, just like adding like restaurants like i've added a new restaurant because we, i had there's a lot of cafes in this world so if you guys want to see anything in particular please let me know and what you guys think about this new pack coming out because i'm sure you've seen from some of the other game changers that um it's you know it, it's like really it's really cutesy it's really really cutesy <laughs> um and yeah I, we're getting to the end of this video um so yeah look out for another video um i'm going to try to vlog when i'm away so like we'll see if we get some like lifestyle-ish content too which is fun something i do every now and then when i go on vacation with friends um and yeah i love you guys all so 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 much um and i will talk to you guys soon okay bye 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 no, you stay even when you want to walk away when time Get bad. We can learn to love what we have. I don't